somebody. I can see Nickelodeon creating this spin-off series. Actually, I'm gonna avoid Nickelodeon right now. Disney. We're gonna go with Disney. I'm gonna I'm gonna blame Tiff. I mean, I don't think anyone else can play with your token. <laughs> You can blame me all you like. Okay. I blame you. <laughs> it will just make no difference. Oh, I wasn't worried about it. I just wanted to be able to blame somebody. Okay. It isn't me for once. It's a miracle. Oh, Aki will get blamed later. Don't worry. Oh. Aki has always done something worth being blamed for. Yeah, well, is going to blame him. Okay. <laughs> we all ready to start? Of course! As soon as I put this piece of chocolate uh, in my mouth, it has coffee in it. Okay. It is well in the pick. Is it some of those pocket coffees? Mm-hmm. Oh, those are so good. I need to order more. I'm just too lazy when it comes to spending money on me. Way too lazy. What was that, Tiff? You're almost out of pocket coffees and you need to order more. I swear if you're saying that just loud enough for Jenna to hear it, we'll throw hands. Bring it. <laughs> can't prove anything. Mm -hmm. Oh, and before we get really started, I owe you an apology. One. Creating anxiety for you on Friday, apparently. Was it anxiety? I had no anxiety on Friday. Mm -hmm. I had more annoyance than anything. I was I was informed that my <clears throat> poor timed coincidental laughter was not a uh, good thing. Well it was just annoying. But we can discuss that later. Okay. It's fine. I'm not that upset over it. I don't I don't hold that type of stuff to heart, <laughs> otherwise you lose the fun of the game. There's fun in this game? If it wasn't fun, I wouldn't play it. Oh, okay. And I would cancel all my sessions and make my players have to live in agony of never knowing the endings. Stream died at the end. See, I had a DM oh, do that died. once and I just made up the ending myself. That's the only non-retired character I have sitting up on a shelf. <laughs> However, I digress as uh oh, oh, Ryan oh, oh, oh. you're oh, gonna oh. give the recap. Which, Which one? Five <laughs> E Ryan. It so. oh, was the one that okay. stayed quiet. Oh let's <laughs> think. And here I was going to volunteer. So this was before we made our trade. Pretty sure we started off the session with Q and Jay talking to Orzikul. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, there was some more talking, people went to bed. Some discussions on what the plan was going to be for the next day, but we were waiting until the morning. People were waking up. Then there was a meeting in the war room. Uh, a lot of people forgot some things. Uh, and then... Well, nothing happened in, nothing other happened in that room. <laughs> ah, great times. Uh, a book was ripped. Oh, oh, yeah, a page out of the book was ripped. I almost forgot about that. Um... Yeah. However, the plan was to just go through with the meeting with, uh, what? Uh, 
vampire, elf, baron. I can't find. Uh, but we didn't even see him, anyways. We met his butler when we went there. In the meeting with his butler, we just gave over a sack of gold. He removed the curse, I think, and then we left. You're forgetting something important. Better Why was the master not there? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. Lady was Gregman. That's right. That's right. Oh, um, quick Akio is very uh, fertile. <laughs> God, I hope that's not his kid. Discussion about Akio's pullout game was made. <laughs> yeah. Akio's 100% foolproof pet plan. Of pulling out. <laughs> uh, and then I think we went right to the keep after that. And then at the keep. I have a question. I think we just loitered around here for a while, started talking to people, and then was Dream <laughs> was having a really bad time, and I think that's where we left off? Yeah. We spoke with Winfield's yeah. father. We spoke with Winfield's father, that's right. Yep. <laughs> With well, the person that we couldn't find's father in Talmudin. Cool. Uh, yep, hey, that was my Mrs. super post recap. Mrs. DM. Hmm. I have a question when it comes to, uh... <laughs> oh god. I have a question when it comes to pulling out in D&D. Is it a deck save? No, I don't think it's a deck save. <laughs> so, does that mean that a higher performance is better for it, or a lower performance is better for it? I think specifying is better for it. Okay. <laughs> um, so... I think if you tell your DM, hey... I'm gonna pull out of this bitch. <laughs> then, like, okay. Make a deck save. Oh. <laughs> deck save! <laughs> okay. Thank you for I, I hope, I but hope I'm also you're very pretty quick. sure when I made you uh, do all that, you didn't specify anything, so it was up to DM's no, discretion of imagination. No, no, it, that is 100 percent fair. I was just I was curious how that would be. It's okay, it's Akio babies. Yeah, I hope not. <laughs> Weirdly not the first person in the party to bear children. Oh, you mean somebody transformed as a human that impregnated a person who didn't know? What is that kid gonna look like? I could be a past pastor <laughs> Oh great, now I have to fight my son and or daughter later in this campaign, that'd be great. Dun dun dun. It's okay, I'll side with your child. I know you would. <laughs> Anyways, the world's yours. I'm on the wrong map, DM. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this road is lovely at all, but... Go home. Hey, I'm home! Crib's in a room. <laughs> when Akio wakes up, he's gonna um, do an hour of meditation, play his long rest. If that's how that works, or when Swim wake up, he's gonna take an hour to do it. Long rest? So, I don't, like, to complete a long rest correctly, um, don't you sleep for X amount of hours and then it's like light activity after that? Yes, but we, we, your long rest was a while ago. Oh, yeah, never mind. I don't know why I thought we were just waking up. Sorry about that. No. I got recapped. My bad. You finished oh. your long rest. We had our meeting. Yeah, you're right. I and, don't know why. And, I and did what bed. we did. And then we came back, which was like 
hour and a half, I think Akio it was. Akio went back to sleep hoping to wake up and start the day all over. <laughs> yeah, he's just trying to forget. <laughs> no, my, that's my bad. We, we've all had those days. But yeah, straight, straight to the room. <laughs> so, uh, Jay is going to look at Melinda, who he hasn't really had a chance to talk too much over this time. Uh, how, how are you doing through all this? Well, I think I'm figuring things out. I do want to have a chance to talk to you more, but I think the very much probably crying the elf girl running down the stairs is very impressive. I think that's a good idea, considering I saw the boy slink down the stairs, too. I'll cut his head off. I'll cut oh, his head God. off. Yeah, <laughs> I hope she doesn't kill him. <laughs> Jay will stand up though. Uh, is. Uh, what's her name? Uh. Or, is that a he or the sh. That's two daughters, right? The, uh. uh it's a daughter and a son. The, okay, that is a son. Okay, that's what I thought. They're um, elves! I know. I know. Elf children. They all could be female, but they uh, could all also Jenna be male. Oh, you gave a gifted sub, Glenn. Oh, apparently I did. There you go. Uh, I, know, I always just Jay is going to try and uh, distract the child with Melinda though, and have so he can go slink off. I mean, not cool. I mean, as not not cool, not, cool. not, cool. not hard because Melinda looks cool because they're elves that have only been raised in an elven village, with maybe the occasional traveler. And she's not just a satyr, but she's a more moose-like satyr, which is not a common see. So they're easily distracted. How many stairs? <laughs> However, stream, there is a door creaking open if you're paying attention. You get past the locked door? <laughs> Okay, what kid doesn't have a thieves tool his hidden in their pocket in D&D? This one. I wouldn't be surprised based on how I met him. <laughs> we just like breaking down here's not that places. strong. I mean, she's under the water. I don't know if she'd see the door creaking open if she's sitting at the bottom well i don't know if it's necessarily seeing as much as soon there's a shadow like cast over your pond because i imagine this isn't lit so he really can't see all that much so he really can't see that you're down there it's not lit at all exactly there's not a single light on the, in the bay, in her area. And so, Stream, you're in your pond crying, and then now there's something laying and crushing you on top of you. Because he can't see. So he fell in the water? <laughs> yeah, he can't see, and he's walking and feeling along the walls. Oh, Jay, you I just hear a splash. I want, I want to give points to the DM. Inadvertently referencing the pit and the pendulum. <laughs> he thinks for a second before grabbing him and swimming him to the top of the water. <laughs> uh, Stream hey. contemplating murdering the kid and just <laughs> holding him under the water. Uh, Diff, check Twitch for like one second. I just got told that. Ooh. 
Um, and I'm just gonna throw him out of the water onto the land. Gosh dang it. Okay. Had that one. Missed you too, Jish. Alright, you, you throw the kid on the land who's now coughing up water because he could not see that there was just water. Um. Hmm. I'm just gonna watch him from like just under the surface. She hears him coughing. It means there's air in there. <laughs> <laughs> is Jay opening the door? Is he just waiting? Uh. Well, is the door open already? Yeah, he didn't close okay. it. He's just gonna slowly crack the door open, standing in there as a silhouette in the doorway. Can he figure out the situation that's happening in there? <laughs> well, you can see the kid he can't see. He's patting the ground and kind of like figuring out where the water is now. And uh, I can see him, right? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Jay is just gonna walk over to him, pick him up by like his uh, coat collar, kind of, you know, by the scruff, <laughs> and then just walk him to the door, set him outside. Good on you for trying. And he's gonna <laughs> close the door. Okay. Stream is retreated back to the bottom of the pond. <laughs> At some point, as you're walking away you would just hear things getting knocked around as he is just meandering through this dark room. Just wait till he trips in the bone pit. Oh, you know... <laughs> he's gonna think about that for a second. <laughs> walk, walk back outside, walk into this door, and then uh, close that door and lock it. Okay. Yeah, Come you know, make Maybe feeding him to a mimic is not the best. Yeah, you don't yeah. want him to wander into that room. <laughs> uh... It's fine. He tripped in the bone pit. There was like a 1 in 20 chance that he picked up a human skull. Oh, actually, uh, Jay's going to pull out his uh, folding chair. He's going to sit it down. It's been a while since Jay has pulled out the folding chair. He's going to sit outside of the, the pond. Dad's back. got his that fucking folding chair. So, can you even hear me in there, stream? Can I hear him? <laughs> it, it's faint and it's warbled, but you can you can tell the base of Jay's voice because it's not the first time he's sat above your pond. Uh, Jay will use thaumaturgy and then repeat the sentence. <laughs> now, I can either use that and you can hear while you're in the pond and it'll be uh more comfortable for you or everyone else won't be able to hear it you can come up here with me you go swim to the surface hey shroom she's not leaving the pond though But she's at least not under the water completely anymore. So, I can tell something is absolutely destroying your mental capacity. However, I don't think it's because Windfiend's father came here. However, I think it was set off by that. So can you just tell me how you're feeling at least? It's gonna take a long, hard, just silence of thinking. If you want to, like, soak back in the water and think for, like, 20 minutes, you can, and I'll, I'll just be waiting up here.
<laughs> I've made a lot of mistakes. Isn't that enough? <laughs> no. I, I've made a lot of mistakes too. That that doesn't doesn't mean anything. Life is a very long marathon that some have a lot shorter than others, but the unlucky ones like us, we have a really long marathon to run. And we got a lot of mistakes to make on the way. However, some mistakes last a lot longer than others. Is there any mistakes that you want to talk about? Because, I mean, if you have someone else to hear them, it might not even be your fault that they happen. You might be seeing it as a mistake on your part, or it might be something else entirely. Um, that's a really long list. I mean, a big one would be I'm the reason the hero of the Year of Fire is dead. Sweet. Uh, does Jay know that person? Uh, yes, her father. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, uh, Dream. <laughs> is that in the prophecy that Jay heard once upon a time? That was you, like there was a hit. There, there's a history book that she that um, I yeah. think most of the party has read at this point. That that tells of his death. I'm, I'm pretty sure we know that. It's been a while. I thought of it. I don't even know where the book is right now. It's somewhere in my items. <laughs> there it is. Um, I found it. Sorry, I had to call my mom. It was stuff for her birthday. Okay. But what was the question? Oh, it, it wasn't anything entirely. Okay. Okay. It was just thinking through lore and stuff that we actually know. No, especially Jay with traveling this long. I'm yeah. pretty sure she's forced most people to read the history book that specifically has a section about her father's death. <laughs> and but, but... How do you feel about those mistakes? Because you've thought about these things for a while. And they started as, I'm sure, a certain feeling, and then they turned into other emotions. Other things. Well... I got him killed, and now I'm trying to 
fill his shoes, and I can't because he was an undefeated hero, and I am very not that. That might be true. Now if you're trying to do something... You're trying your hardest. You're... Risking your life. And I'm pretty sure he would be proud of you still. You just gotta shake your head, no? <laughs> I mean, noth I know nothing that I'm gonna say is gonna make you change your way of thinking, but I, I just... I want you to be verbal about how you feel and not just sink into a pool of water and become <sighs> a really soggy sea cucumber. I know Man. you're really smart and you probably thought about ways about changing it. that at this point I'm a hindrance <laughs> no hold, hold on stream stream you're not saying that to me you are not saying that to me with <laughs> you in this party are the thing that I can depend on the most you will keep going until you physically drop dead and then even after you drop dead even if I pick you back up, you will continue to try and try until you die. But in the end, I always fail. Doesn't matter if you fail, just if you try. You'd have the drive. Doesn't matter how much skill or talent you have if you don't have the passion behind it. You're just gonna sink into the water more. <laughs> That's not enough at this point. <laughs> if it weren't for you... We wouldn't be anywhere at near as far as we are. Okay, well, we're gonna pull those cards. I have a lot. I've got a really big deck that I have here, <laughs> just of cards that I have ready. Okay. Oh no. <laughs> oh, I almost died because of a curse. You know, I I think that's like a a king here. You can have this king. Okay. Melinda is saved. You know what? I, I think I'm gonna rate that an ace. Okay. I, I can keep going here, and I can keep pulling cards of things that I have that I'm already somehow indebted to you. But I don't think I need to. 
you know all of the good things you've done, and you failed, but you succeeded, and you staved, and you've also taken. But the fact that you're you keep going and that you keep trying, that's truly how you stay undefeated. Your passion and stay unwavering. I mean, you probably knew your father better than most people. He always probably believed in what he was doing, right? Mm hmm. And he always succeeded. I'm sure that in his triumphs, there was also failures that he learned from and used to then propel himself on to a victory. Uh, I'm sure you know sword fights and just fights in general. They are very long, almost chess matches of trying to whittle down an opponent's endurance, patience, health in some times in some cases and you can lose some of those tiny things you can lose maybe a sword stroke and only get your leg cut a little bit but As long as you're surviving at the end of it, that's what matters. Or... If you're sacrificing yourself for something that you truly believe in, like... your daughter... Yeah, I could lose for that. I don't want to talk for him, though. I don't want to talk for you. for me he lost because of it and that was his only loss he'd ever got if he died and you are still alive in no matter what battle and how that battle ended I'm sure he is. I'm not going to speak, and I don't want to, but if I was in the situation, I'm happy with my daughter surviving, no matter how the battle. And if she went to go and carry on fighting demons and never forgetting my name and continuing to live with the guilt as her driving passion to continuing to get stronger and stronger to eventually continue and win the war that I was fighting in, I'd say that battle... It was worth it in the end. But that's only if she went to go ahead and continued to fight in this war for him and 
win. Or at least try to win. Go shake your head no again while trying to think. gonna just float under the water for a bit. <laughs> Jay will simply sit in his chair and wait. He's way too good at rendering her speechless. He wouldn't be the group dad without <laughs> it. gonna come back up and actually get out of the water this time. <laughs> say this, what do you mean? Like a weakling? Define weakling. Me. That's the definition. <laughs> That's not a definition. I know you have read many books. I want... At least a definition that a uh, academy scholar would be proud of. How would I know? I've never been to an academy. I've read a lot of books that have been written by academies. It's just hard to explain. If you can't define it, then I don't think you even know what it is until you truly really can figure out how to put I it I know what word. strength is. And I'm the opposite of that. You don't need to be strong. I know you know that. I do for what I'm fighting. So, are you trying to do something to get stronger? I'm gonna have to. 
I... Jay's gonna look around and see if there's a snake around here. It's coiled it's... around her neck. Is it still in the collar? Okay, I thought it. I thought she it still was has the collar. collar. Okay. Yeah, she's still right. wearing the collar, quote unquote. So, have you fallen out of favor with her and she's not giving you power anymore? Or not? That's a good question. It did make her mad. Go try to cast Eldritch Blast and see if I still have my magic. <laughs> I don't like when the DM takes a sip before answering. <laughs> I can take a longer one. Concern. Give me a deck save stream. Nine. You gotta cast the magic, and in turn, it reverses back and hits you. You seemingly can't control the magic you once controlled. Ow. Yeah, you're right. You can't fight like this. What'd you right. do, I... Just when I needed another thing to, to add up to why I cannot do this. Yeah, you're right, Stream. In your current state, you can't fight. <laughs> and you can't adventure. Can you can still... Your sword fighting still... okay? I mean, he asked. I'm gonna swing at him. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> sure! I don't if think that gets affected. If, yeah, sure. <laughs> if Glenn Nat wants, I'm gonna laugh my ass off. So there's no there's no shield on this, so it's gonna be a no. little bit easier to hit. Twenty five. <laughs> She's not trying to hit Jay, <laughs> but just close enough to yeah, that, to that test hits. her skill. That hits. It's like the tip of the scimitar just kind of grazes across your scales. So you can fight at half your strength. I didn't know you could get less than zero. No, half is more than zero. If you were at zero, then you would not even have half. If you like, think of a glass. If the glass is half empty, it's either half empty or it's half full. Which way do you think, Scream? The glass is empty. No, it has to have something. <laughs> There's something in the glass. It's either half full or it's half empty. Which one is it? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> it just keeps staring at you. What have you thought about maybe fixing it? I didn't know it was broken. Well, something can be... Well... I wouldn't say broken. I guess broken isn't the right word. She's obviously very displeased with you. Mm -hmm. 
have you thought about mending the relationship? I haven't had time. But you haven't thought about anything? All I've done is make her angrier. Do you feel like it's justified? Of course. Can I make an insight check? You can. No. Is stream being brain damaged? Uh... Twenty-one. I mean... When she, when she, when she says, of course, it's, it's justified. There is not a hint of her that thinks that it's not justified. Hmm. She, she just has a very guilty expression on her face. So you want to try and mend this, right? I mean, she's like fam. I don't have a lot of that left. So do you want help? I've dug my hole. Biggest pain in the ass of the year goes to stream. <laughs> Always. Second wind. Um, well, did you dig that hole that you're actually... Oh, wait, no, you're out of that now, so I can't say that anymore. <laughs> Damn it. And yes, she dug that hole too. <laughs> did dig that hole. There was no hole down so, here. <laughs> I, I, I have a question, Stream. Did you just uh, get out of that metaphorical hole that you were uh, swimming in before and climb out of it? Mm -hmm. Do you think that that's attainable in your relationship with... I don't want to say her name. <laughs> I don't want to say Not her right name. Now. <laughs> Sure, it is. It's gonna take time. I guess that means we're staying here though until. No. 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 We're gonna keep going. Are you sure? Do you think our enemy's gonna wait? I mean, you just said you haven't had time. So how are you going to have time if we go to the next part of our mission? That you have no time to... You're not making yourself time stream. I'll figure that out. Alright, I'll, I'll stop bothering you, stream. I don't want to pest you any longer. I just... I don't know if you got anything out of this. I just want to talk to you. Maybe a couple of answers. Oh, and Jade, else? before you go, how could 
of a leader do you think you are? Nope. I can't lead. Not one bit. I'm gonna jump in the water, and as she does, don't think you'll have a choice. <laughs> and she's just gonna swim back to the bottom of her pond. <laughs> the ominous, ominous way she does everything. <laughs> Ominous. Jay will slowly close the door behind him. Alright, stream drowns. <laughs> Too bad she can't. Yeah. I'm gonna drown that fish. <laughs> Maybe in lava? Is the kid still outside of the door? <laughs> yeah, did he ever find his way up the stairs? He never tried to find his way up the stairs. He just sat waiting. <laughs> this whole time. <laughs> yeah. Jay, Jay will look down at him. <laughs> you know, you might have had more luck than I would have had. So. Probably should have brought some kind of torch down here. Do you have a torch on ya? <laughs> I can tell you where the person with the nearest torch probably is. I can't help but uh, laugh. Jay will take out a... No, that's not gonna work. Jay will move him upstairs. <laughs> Jay just quit. <laughs> I'm not dealing with this right now. If you want to come back down the stairs with a rudely made torch and potentially burn something down and make her angry, that is fine by me, but just not with my knowledge of it. Well, he's going to begin searching for a torch. There's bound to be torches somewhere in here. I think this is her, man. Oh, my goodness. No torches, just candles. Candle's better than nothing. <laughs> It'll take a bit, but he will find one. But I want to give other people a chance before going right back into stream. Damn. Hugh's busy. God help the uh, person who disturbs her. I uh, yeah, it's just meditating right now. Don't disturb Q. <laughs> well, I guess Jay will spend some time with Melinda. Alright. Um, real quick. Um, Akio would, um, open his eyes and look at Jay. How'd it go? I see your facial reactions are uncertain. Honestly? I'm trying to think if Jay would make any of it verbal. I don't think he would. I don't think he would share it. She's just a little... Processing. I will say, she probably looked worse when you left, mainly because of the fact that she now discovered... She can't even use her powers? You know what? It's better now than later. That's my logic. Middle of a fight. Oh. Uh, I think she's just really shaken up. And... She's having some family issues. I don't mean to pry. I'm just more or less worried about I mean, about if you want to go downstairs and ask her yourself, you can. It's not like her <laughs> door is, like, unlocked, or 
She might have locked it, but you can still knock on her door. Jay. You are a thousand times closer to her than I am. Okay. I am. I hope she knows that I care, but as he's saying that, he kind of stops for a moment. I don't want to pester her. It is better if you went down there rather than I. So... Because I know her a thousand times better, that means that I only see stream in this best way, like little box, okay? And I'm so used to seeing this little box that I can't see the different things that this little box is doing because I've seen this little box for so long. Following what I'm saying? Yes. You're stuck in a perceptive you are stuck with biasness in a way. Yes. Uh, I know her really well, and I can talk to her and understand her because of it. But also, I can see things, or I might miss something and not get that across to her because I also am, I guess, just a little bit bigger box. Okay, I see what you're saying. And then you are just a also different furrier box. I don't know why I'm talking about boxes so much. I understand. <sighs> I... Jay likes boxes, confirm. Part of me wants to go down and make sure she's okay. The other part of me wants her to have her peace. I'm trying to figure out which one would so, be more advantageous. I'm just going to tell you this right now. No single bit of thought that crosses her mind is going to be a single peaceful thought. And honestly, yeah, I'm, I'm sharing way too much right now. Go down and talk to her yourself, but nothing that she's thinking right now is peaceful. So you can't... I guess you can do worse. You really might be able to do worse, but I tr trust... <laughs> Trust you. <laughs> Trust you. Jay. Don't force what you're saying. In this situation, when there is absolutely nothing to do, yes, I trust you. I was going to tease you, but I, I really hope you're not. You know what I meant by that. I don't. I really don't. <sighs> I was going to say that in this case, there's nothing that could quote unquote bad happen, but if there was another more serious thing, you wouldn't trust me. I was going to do so first off, you never ever say the words there's nothing that could possibly go wrong or oh. there's nothing worse that could happen. There's always or something blank. That could yeah. yeah. I was yeah, just, just giving the sky and say the name of a demon, see what happens. Yeah, or go down there and say no I'm not gonna say that either, even give you the idea. I get that she's in a rough spot. And Maybe a close friend such as yourself and an outsider might be able to give her a better perspective. 
Well, I already talked to her. She is definitely finished entirely hearing from me. She probably wants to talk to me no longer. She's heard what I have to say, and until she processes any of the information or a new thing she just learned, she's not going to think on it. However, you may have different bits of information, and if it's just you two, she might be more receptive, because I'm not there potentially also throwing my words onto it. <sighs> that make any How sense? are you doing? Me? Yes. You're tense. I can clearly see that. My man's scared. Uh... I'm doing great, actually. I'm doing amazing. I want to incite that. Okay. <laughs> uh, uh, so, fuck. <laughs> I mean, me myself, I'm in a better situation than I was before. Well, Linda's safe. Nurse is happy. Uh, we owe 3,000 gold, which kind of sucks, but that's that's only money. 3,000 gold is not the end of the world. No, it is not. Oh, he actually beat me. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, I, was surprised by that. I rolled an 18 with Jay. I thought I was going to get away with it. No, he's not doing great. He... Not... There's not a desperate look on his face, but there's a constantly thinking of trying to think how to fix it. He's in, I gotta fix something right now because things are going wrong. You know, the dad thought. It's also the first time Jay's ever seen her like this. Jay. Stream's never broken. <laughs> yeah, what do you need, Akio? You're going to make a joke out of this, but... Look me in the eyes. Okay. <laughs> he said it okay. first. <laughs> I whispered Take a deep breath. Uh, Once you're done taking that deep breath, imagine yourself outside of your body, looking around at everything around you. I know it's probably stressful, at the very least, but you need okay, Glenn. to, rather than, <sighs> you can't worry about something that you have not, <sighs> how do I put it? You're thinking at a very rapid pace, I can tell that. Looking at every option, when you need to examine and pick the right one. Because if you continue to... How do I say? You're going to probably mess up somewhere, because you're rushing it. I'm rushing it. I'm not. It took his time. <laughs> I. I'm not wise, and I know I'm not intelligent. But even I can see desperation. Not desperation. Sorry, wrong words. Sorry, translation. I can see that there's nervousness in you. And you need to expel that and co at things with a calm mind. Or else things might not turn out the way we wish. Thank 
thank you for the advice. I know it. I truly appreciate that. I might be good at certain things, but wisdom is not one of them. I... I think the saying is slow and steady wins the race. In most cases, yes. yes. However, there are some cases that don't allow that. Well, whatever it is, we will find a way. Like, As light example. Does. Say there was a fire to set in that forest out there. Yes. Would you rather take it at a slow and steady pace to get rid of this fire, or a quick but potentially erratic? Every situation calls for its own merits. I will give you that. And since we have this different outlook on things, it feeds into my point even more why I shouldn't be there when we're talking with stream if you were to go talk with stream. Because you have your own viewpoint on things, she would see things a different way hearing things from you. And potentially her, she needs to see it that way. Let her take the information we give her and let her decide her own course of actions. That is. I mean, you also don't need to do it now, you can do it later, but, you know, do it whenever. I'm going to do it in a moment. However, there is one more thing I want to say. I do not know what mindset she's in right now, but I know that. I know that both of us know that life finds a way. So. The thing is, is yes, life does find a way. However, death also has an uncanny way of becoming inevitable, and that's what we need to worry about here over life. We do not have these useful professions. That's as big a pain as Jay's gonna give you. Okay, we'll stand up and look at Jay. Thank you for listening. I'm hopefully going to go and park something on stream. Hopefully it's nothing bad. You can see that even he's a little uncertain. <laughs> Go talk to Q about it if you aren't sure what to say. Perhaps your slow and erratic, not slow and erratic, slow and methodical route is much better if you plan along it and talk to people along the way. Or go down there with Q too. That could also work. Q still doing the painting stuff? way to find out. Akio's gonna look around and uh, notice that she's not in the room. Eh. I don't want to overload the stream. If I'm assuming she's not in a good spot. I don't want to overwhelm her. She's yeah. probably already overwhelmed. And 
she could very much just not want me in there, and I will understand, and I will come right back. However, I will see you all in a while. is gonna start walking. Uh, hey, Jay. <laughs> yeah? I don't remember how to get there. What do you mean? I don't think I've ever been to where she is. You know, to be fair, I don't think he has. No, he has not. He, unlike, Jay, Jay he, is I going he... to... to... To rub rub his face and his eyes, stand up and walk down the stairs. Is there a bit there? I forgot. I don't think we ever gave Akio a tour like we did Q. You did not. Nope. He knows the he knows where the bedrooms are in the main hall in the war room now. That's it. Well, Wait, she lives she below the dungeon. Lead you down. Lead you down the stairs. The, uh, it's the first door on the right. Right? Can't walk up the I... stairs! <laughs> first door on the right, got it! Walks in, sees door on the right, okay. <laughs> um... Akio's gonna knock. There's a knock back. There's a knock <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's not that odd. <laughs> Weird. Stream. You hear scurrying sounds. <sighs> I'm gonna try to open it. That you door open doesn't it. get locked. <laughs> you open it and you see a. T You're not quite certain what it is, but there is a stream in the room. We can turn into people. <laughs> when did when did my fucking mimic learn to mimic people? I'm gonna walk Ace is a lot smarter than you give that mimic credit. I'm going to. I close haven't taught this behind. thing shit. <laughs> <sighs> so, can you describe? It's like a, what like? <laughs> I was going to describe. So, Tip, how is it like? sitting or how is or how is she sitting hugging her yeah. knees just eyes locked onto you i heard you um heard you weren't doing so well stream a hand is like stuck out to you Uh, I swear, if you yeah. kill my fucking mimic. I'm not going to kill the mimic. <laughs> I might. He's going to kill Stream. I I might dimension door. <laughs> and then go yell at. I uh, or gonna go yell at uh, a dragonborn in a moment. Um, he'll lock up and. <laughs> to hold on his hand. Give me a deck save with disadvantage. Shit. Oh. I love pseudopods. Oh, wow, a six. Could have been a 19 if it wasn't disadvantage. You, you give Stream a hand up, and you're not really thinking about it, but you can't let go of her hand. Say that Stream's hand is sticky. <laughs> I'm and the, going to. <laughs> sorry. Well, and then the hand kind of like starts to envelop your hand. Uh, and you're beginning to now pick the little details of Stream that are not right with this stream. I have to see something to miss you step, right? 
Misty step, you have to have line of sight. Dimension door, I don't. But I'm afraid that if I dimension door, because you can take somebody with you, I don't know if it has to be willing or not, or if it's attached to you. It's you have to choose to take it with you. Yeah. So I don't... Okay, so I can kill You yourself I choose if, if something comes with so, you. So, I can see that this thing is enveloping my hand right now. Yeah, it's not hurt hurting or anything. It's just it's it's got a sucky grip on your hand. Uh, <laughs> I know this is stream now, right? Like I said, you, when you're up close now, you're beginning to recognize the little details that are off that this is not stream. Don't fireball the mimic. Don't fireball the mimic. It's not been violent with you. I know. I'm just <laughs> <laughs> Technically, still a child. You could fireball it. I know, right? Gosh, that's why I can't accept that. <clears throat> huh. Let's see. Can I try to pull away? You can try. I'm gonna try pulling away before I resort to my higher level magic. <laughs> What do I make? I guess I'm gonna decide to get some like strength, right? Uh, yeah. Okay, just straight strength? Mm hmm. Damn it. <laughs> well, it is a baby mimic, mind you. So it's not that strong yet. So you do pull away from it. And then it, it goes back into a little chest form and it tears little little tears just start welling up in its eyes. And it just starts crying. No 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 Akio's about to actually feel my fur mimic holy shit. Akio is going to like get close now and just like rub its head. Is that possible? I'm about to get eaten, alright. You, you rub the top of its weird, squishy, chest-like head. And at just the beginning of the touch of you patting it, it screams more. Mm. Wow. Ha. Huh. Stream, the top of your water is starting to just vibrate. Uh, just went to the top. <laughs> ah, shit. <laughs> As your head gets out of the water, you are recognizing why it's vibrating on the top, because it is high-pitched screaming. Gosh, I have calm emotions right now. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna rush out and see what's going on. <laughs> you go into the mimic room and you see your mimic crying and screaming, Akio petting its head. <laughs> I am trying to calm it down. And you can tell Aki is just frantic, trying to calm down this creature. Does it have any food on him either? It's like just gonna... To she's gonna sink her head into her hand, reach down onto the ground that's littered with bones, grab one, and toss it across the room. <laughs> Yeah, he doesn't see you throw the bone, just keeps screaming, crying. <laughs> Do I notice the bone, or no? You notice stream through a bone. Is there one near me? I'm gonna go with yes, but I'm gonna tell you the screaming is way louder than it needs to be. I'm probably gonna get my hand chewed up. I'm gonna pick up a bone and try to, like, putting it near it to try to see if it'll chomp or not. What's Jay's passive perception? Um, 18. You can just hear in like the distance the sound of something screaming, Jay. Oh. 
How is everyone else reacting? Can they hear it? Um... Susie doesn't have that high of a perception. But that's true. The second that Susie cares about it, then Jay will worry about it. But you also don't know where Susie is. Oh, yeah, true. Um... The amethyst oh, oh, oh. dragon at your table is reacting. And it's just staring at the stairs down to the basement. Nice. Like, beady-eyed locked. Mm. Well. I'm sure Aki will be fine. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, sure. We can all hope. <laughs> that means Scream would have had to have let him die. Like... However, the Mimics does not seem to notice what's in your hands if you are trying to just wave it in front of him, per se. Scream's just gonna walk over to her Mimic and try to pick it up. Do you pick Ace up? Why are you in this room? I, um, I, I, I came to come talk to you. And Jay said, um, the first door on the right, and then it led me here. I didn't mean to upset the mimic. I'm very sorry, stream. I, um, Is so it okay? <laughs> After you picking it up, it's it's slowly starting to settle. <sighs> you didn't know where my room was? I, uh, never got toward the basement. I only knew where the um, upper floor and main hall were. What do you mean? I just wanted to come by and. I just wanted to come by and check up on you, is all. I didn't mean to cause an issue. Or a commotion. Well, as you can see, I'm perfectly fine. Okay, time to see if I can insight that one. <laughs> <laughs> what streams deception? Good. Okay. I am we got this. Phone. We might actually no. got this. I net 20 for a 21. Damn it! <laughs> You tried fine. real hard, Akio. Actually, did Jay? Which I have disadvantage. Wait, wait, <laughs> Jay. Did Jay tell Akio that he did not think Stream was okay still? Yeah. 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 So Stream disadvantage. Okay, let's see. Joey advantage. That's a sixteen. I fa I'm gonna fail regardless. Yeah. Well, I'm curious. What did I grow? Yeah, that would have been bad. She is. She is very much not okay. <laughs> yeah, and you can tell she's lying. In fact, you see a lot of fresh wounds. She dodged a lot of the magical blasts, but <laughs> can't dodge them all. <coughs> I know I'm not. <sighs> I know I don't have the highest standing. And. Aren't you like in line for a throne? That's like 
some of the highest standing you can have. In terms of your friendship, if if I'm even past acquaintance yet. If we were only acquaintances, do you think he'd be traveling with us? Then I appreciate you reassuring me of that. And... <laughs> I can tell that there is a great deal on your shoulders right now that you are thinking about. I did not come by to lecture. I just came by to make sure that you knew that not, not only you have a lot of people that care. At least I hope you knew that. And I am more recent, but I too care. I don't I don't know what ails you, but I know that whatever it is, you will get through it. It may not seem like it, but Even, even f flowers and things of the such grow in harsh climates, they find a way. And... Did you just compare me to a flower? Uh, I'm not good at this. I'm trying to say you are a very resilient person. And I know that will I know that you're going to do great things even if you don't believe it you're not wrong well at least die valiantly like my father Akio just kind of <laughs> smiles a little at that. It's funny that you think that me or Jay are gonna let you fall like that. You'll try to, to stop it. <laughs> and if you do, thank you. I... You don't need to thank me for it. It's what friends do. I'm gonna set Ace down and, like, walk out of the room. Akio is gonna start following. I... Would you like to be left alone? Do what you want. <laughs> She's just gonna walk into her room and you hear a splash. <laughs> Akio will walk in. It's still dark, isn't it? <laughs> there's yeah, but no you light in. Yeah. Shadow, okay. there's no light on this entire floor. Correct. <laughs> oh, cool. So it's all gray. <laughs> all gray. Honestly, it's probably a really creepy sight because it's an all gray room with this girl crawling into this like pit of water. Yeah, it's definitely like something out of a horror movie. <laughs> yeah, it's like something uh, out of the, the ring. Mind yeah, you, the room the has a lot of dissection tools in it. <laughs> it's straight out of a horror movie, actually. This whole with floor no is bones, weapon scars, a mimic and torture room. And a and, and streams room, which doubles as a dissection chamber. Akio is going to 
Wait a second. Was she back in the pond? <laughs> You might regret this. This is going to cost him a spell slot. Um, <laughs> I just put uh, stream up in uh, themes. Ooh, let's see. Yeah. <laughs> Probably looks pretty close to it. I, I, <laughs> so I don't see stream, but I can kind of guess you went in the water, correct? How deep do you think my pond is? I don't know. <laughs> I thought it was a well. Uh, the well's guessing... outside. <laughs> the well's outside. I'm guessing if I cast... This is a, this is a man-made spa, uh, pond. I'm guessing if I cast Alter Self, I can't really talk underwater, can I? It doesn't change your physiology. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? It means I mean, genetic... It does, but not... <laughs> not... You change look-wise, but your actual makeup, you still breathe air. No, uh, Alter Self oh, lets you oh, yeah. Alter Self give is yourself still... gills. Yeah, then you can talk underwater. Okay. <laughs> then, I'm gonna cast Alter Self on myself. For a second spell. And then he's gonna get into the water. Hmm. Never First done man. this before. Is going to get into my pond. <laughs> Wait, is it a bed? Oh god. <laughs> I don't know, no one's ever tried it before. <laughs> you think Jay gets into Stream's pond to talk to her? It would sink. All the way on. <laughs> That's where she's at anyways. As, oh yeah, yeah. As Jay said, I pull up my lawn chair. Yep. Yeah, yeah, Akio. Akio doesn't have he doesn't Oh, it's weird. <laughs> Again, you've <laughs> never been down here. Yep. All right. You get in the water and swim down. <laughs> it's like, what, 15 feet, to you, Tiv? 10 feet? Roughly. <laughs> Somewhere along those lines. It's still deep. Yeah. <laughs> you wouldn't want your kid to fall in here looking at a fucking certain blind-ass noble. <laughs> <laughs> Give him a break. Fuck you for being human. <laughs> he tried. He at least tried. <laughs> Don't be mean to the boy. 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 I can call him boy. I'm older than him. Stream just oh, getting at the bottom, though. Call me a boy. Oh. You're but a young lad. Uh, but a wee lad. Oh, <laughs> so how does stream react seeing me down here? There's a glare. <laughs> uh, sorry, probably should have asked before doing this. If you normally, want, normally, normally she can run from the people by. <laughs> oh yeah, right. She going can. in the water. <laughs> stream safety hole has been breached. If you want, I can leave the stream. I understand you don't want me here. Do what you want. <laughs> what do you want? He says to Akio while Akio is in stream's bed. <laughs> this is God, her bed, no. basically. <laughs> she yeah. sleeps meditating at the bottom of this pond. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't get to. He sees a pond. <laughs> Not a bed. I know. That's what makes it fun here. Yep, definitely not the way Stream sees it. It's like it's like me getting into bed, Clint's bed while he's laying down. How you feeling? <laughs> Just think. Autumn, Stream you're writing the fanfic now, you. right? <laughs> no, God no. <laughs> Stream, Stream's like, I can solve this whole Akio problem. Just go up and tell Q right now. Or, you know, just stab him quick, break his concentration, and hold him underwater. Ooh, we're in my door. That's spicy. <laughs> um, you think, you think so? Do you know the oh, verbal I components for that? Yeah. <laughs> oh, God, do you God. have Do you have subtle spell though? I don't. Then no, that that doesn't work for you, unfortunately. <laughs> Shit. 
I you got a do. verbal component that's gonna be full of water. Ah, <laughs> uh, fuck! I knew I should have took some little sort of careful spell. <laughs> oh. They're both good. They're both they good. They are still fireballed a child. <laughs> Carefully. Carefully fireballed a child. Carefully. Fireballed. Yeah. <laughs> time. What do I? I'm assuming one of them is for me to get out of your pot. I want to live up to the name that I'm supposed to represent. See... I understand that completely, because I also represent my family's name, and there's something I've realized, that I am technically an outcast to my people, but that doesn't... it's not a roadblock. I think you are a great person to bear your family's name. You might not see it that way, but you are more capable than most people I've met. Yes, decisions might hamper that, you might feel like you could have done something better or differently. But at the end of this day, you are still stream, the person who single-handedly saved somebody's life by yourself. Out of this... He doesn't know. He... <laughs> You... You... Are... I don't think you give yourself enough credit, Stream. And I think you give me too much. Well, it's all based off of opinion. And I think we just need to... Help you... See yourself in a better light. You don't deserve whatever demons are in your head. I literally do deserve it, though. Explain why. Maybe I'm not understanding something. Just glaring at you. You don't need to tell me, of course, if you don't want to. Trust me, you'd know if I wanted you to know. I know. And I respect your decision not to tell me, because I trust you. You shouldn't. Stream? is I can tell that it's more than just inadequacy that's bothering you or what you think is inadequacy no that's like 99% of it 99% <laughs> there's still 1% <sighs> It's more like that. <laughs> you just gotta close your eyes. Aki was gonna walk a little closer. Well, it's feel like 15 feet. That's like real close already. Um, there isn't much room. 
Wait, how She's wide is at... this? Uh, it's like... I think it's like 15 by 15. If we turn the grid on, it's like 15 feet wide. Okay, who's in the... He's not gonna be up in your face. She's also just sitting on the bottom. Just crisscross applesauce right on the bottom. <laughs> she opens her eyes. How many people can say what we've gone through? We literally suffered in repeated death together. From what I remember. I don't care, but that's not a character bit. When uh, it was that dream thing where we were kept back I know. over and over again. I okay, know what you're sure. talking about. I just wanted to make sure that everyone else remembered that I wasn't going insane. You know, um, and we were going to fight one of the lieutenants of Dagon. Voodoo. With the power where of Where we voodoo. found you. Voodoo to voodoo. You know voodoo. <laughs> voodoo to voodoo. Who saved my life. Yeah. Was... <laughs> Who was accompanying him? Broly. No. Broly was, was not there. there. Broly was there. Was he? Yeah. I thought it was the the dumb which? No. Wizard? The, bell, the wizard? Yeah, I thought... I thought the one like, that was know, giving was birth? Was... <laughs> she was... What? Am I'm I... pretty sure it was Roller. I think you're right. The mo I, That one is a little hazy, but I think you're right. I think it was Roller. I'm going insane. Because I Yvel remember... hasn't traveled with us in a <gasps> very long time. But Yavelle gave me her cape after she... Yeah, left. wait, no, she was there. I think she left. Yeah, she left after that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah, big brain. I that did it. One. Okay, you beat me. <laughs> yeah, it, it was a little hazy. I, I don't remember. That was like a year and a half ago. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Rolly was not there. It was Yavel. What, you gonna hold it over me that your memory is better than mine? <laughs> Damn. Don't trust my words. You know what I'm trying to say. You were there, and you saved me. I had my sword- I- well, no, I didn't have my sword to your throat. I had your own sword to your throat. Ready to slit it the moment you did anything hostile. You don't- you didn't know I was from your foe. It's understandable. You're way too forgiving. It's better than being what I could have been, so... A statue for all eternity? That, and or more like a warmonger who is hateful by nature. Yes, I'm forgiving because you have done a lot for me. And I want to I wish that I could show you how grateful I truly am, but I can't. I basically I know, I you have a, you'll have a good chance here, here soon. Then I'm glad to hear it. Is there any other reason you feel inadequate? You wouldn't understand. Do 
you may be right, but I'm here to try to understand. He's glaring at you again. She doesn't say anything, she just glares. Your defenses are high, and I understand. I... I cannot nearly be anything but understanding after I lied to you all for a few months and two did not trust you with something nearly. I feel I literally hid my identity from everyone for almost a year. I did it for a few months. If anything, I'm the, one of the closest people to understand that. Just tell me. He just nods. There's far more important people to talk to than me. He is about to go until you say that. <laughs> He's going to then turn back around. I'm going to try to hide while he's not looking. You can try. <laughs> you need to hide. You oh, can I've try. Oh, I've got my ways. Natural That's 20 it. again. Yeah, there it is. So 27. <laughs> All right. I, don't even, I, I was expecting a that. shit roll. How do I even roll for that? Perception? Investigation? I mean, I don't have any number to beat that, so... Yeah, I was about to say, does any of the numbers that you roll beat My that? My fucking persuasion could match it if I rolled also a natural 20. Persuade the water to tell you where she is. <laughs> you act like she hasn't already talked to the water. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> you know how many water weirds were killed in this pond? Akio, you step out, and you look around for her. You do not see her. You could attempt to investigate further, but you know better than anyone, when people are stubborn, they hide really well. Akio's going to stand there for a moment, not actually looking. He is going to sigh. He's going to make sure she can hear this next bit. Where are you saying? In the water? Out of the In water? In the water. In the water. Okay. He will say, you may think that you are not important, but I would not spend my time here if I did not think otherwise. And then he'll swim out. And then he will... I was gonna do a really lazy sorcerer, like, sorcerer thing, but he's just gonna walk back. Okay. I didn't think about Dimension Dooring back to where they were. So Akio's gonna come out of the basement soaking wet and yep. <laughs> dripping. Yep. <laughs> yep. Is he still dripping by the time he gets back up here? Probably. Yep. Hey, I am you. sure it's stuck. Hey, Akio. Yes. Do you have a spell press digitation? <laughs> He's going to cast it on himself just to get the water <laughs> off. I'm just <laughs> saying it because I feel like Susie is like probably pretty annoyed with tracking water through. And I just don't want to make her any angrier than she might already be. He's gonna look around when he says that. Is Susie around to witness him tracking water? No. Okay. You're fine this time. Hopefully, no one snitches. They'll be fine if they do. Snitches get stitches. Bitch. Oh, gosh. 
So how'd your talk with stream go? He's gonna look at you. I think you can tell. <laughs> oh, by the way, really quick before we continue this conversation, it was the door on the left, not the right. <laughs> oh, I was I was talking about if you were looking from the staircase. From the staircase, from, like if I was looking at the staircase up Who the stairs. Who does that? <laughs> <laughs> You walk into a room, and you... <laughs> I'm not even gonna... It's whatever. I just made a mimic cry. It's fine. <laughs> did not make me How feel bad whatsoever. Make... How did you make Ace cry? Uh, I'm very confused. It... it put up a really good disguise of stream. I'll start with that. Hmm? It looked like stream really well until I it, sure, but you Ace, that sure? Ace held out its hand to me and I grabbed it thinking it was streams and then it started to envelop my hand. And then what happened? And I pulled it away because I had no idea that well I knew it wasn't stream at that point, not knowing what it was. I pulled my hand away, it got upset, turned back into its mimic form and started to cry. I mean, was it hurting you when it was enveloping your hand? No, I just didn't know what to do. I knew it wasn't stream. Okay. Would I send you into a room that would ever have the chance of killing you? Oh my god. I do yeah, not mean to camera. sound like a dickhead right now. But yes, technically. When have I ever done that before? Were we just at an auction that if we were to do anything bad there, we would have gotten killed? That's technically a room. I put myself in that same room. Still, still could kill me. You never, you never had said you had to be there too. Okay, Akio. Fair enough. I'm not mad. I just I'm disappointed. Don't, I just don't know if that helped. I don't think it helped. I don't know if it hindered my conversation with Stream any more than it did. No, but it made Stream open the door to talk to you in the first place. If anything, that was a good thing then. However, I talked to her in the pond, so there's that. She really what? Talk to her in the pond. <laughs> well, you were wet, so that made sense, but... Yes. She talked didn't... to her in her pond? Yes. Is there an issue? I don't know. Never mind. I'm not gonna <laughs> think into that too much. Well, I knew she didn't want to be outside of it, so I just used Alter Self and then gave myself the ability to breathe and talk. Sorry, I'm thinking of all the bad ways this could be taken. <laughs> and Akio is none the wiser. Whew, I have a bad person. However, we talked. I... She didn't want to tell me what ailed her besides... the way she was feeling. Told you something she didn't even tell Jay. So, did you... Uh, I'm not gonna actually ask her what she told her. She told you... It doesn't matter if I know anything. I mean, honestly, the only thing that matters is if Dream took information in and she gave you some kind of jagged response in return. Did she, like, try and turn it back on herself? Or did she just say, like, okay, and then sink back into the water? She turned a part or two against me, but I cleared it up quickly. Okay, no, that sounds like her. She's too rough on herself. Yeah, but if you want to be the best, that's what you have to do. Be rough on yourself. 
constantly strive to be a perfectionist in every way, shape, and form. Akio just kind of smiles a little at that. It's impossible that's not an attainable goal. Creepo. But. Creepo. <laughs> Thanks. You broke into a little girl's room. Oh my god! <laughs> that's crazy! Dude, that's crazy! I can't help it. Oh, I had... talking about? She's the oldest one here. I had dude. to make if the joke by at her some point. Actual age. Holy shit, dude! She's fucking. I've been She's behaved this whole time. Physically, I think the only person older than her is Jay. <laughs> Question. <sighs> oh, only so I can understand this. Isn't Akio technically older because of the time spent in the statue? No. No, no he's he still was younger. He only in there for two years. Okay. Yeah, he's okay. still technically younger. <laughs> Got it. I'm good. No, yeah, you're good. Yeah. It's a good question to have. <laughs> no, no, that, if, 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 that cleared things up. Oh, God. More. I'm sorry. I could not resist doing that at least once today. <sighs> and trust me, even by that logic, I think Stringer's still Don't worry. Older. <laughs> it was you the guys... actual date of <sighs> her birth. You guys joke with me because you guys care, right? <laughs> yeah. As Tim Look smiles. I'm glad someone I'm made the joke. <laughs> I can't, I'd been good. Yeah, see, beware the smiling DM. Beware the smiling DM. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, gosh. I I see why somebody needs to be harsh on themselves when it comes to becoming better but the way she seems to be right now is more or less more destructive rather than to better oneself. But, like I said, neither of us are stream. We don't know how she feels. Something like that can lead a person to ruin. I've seen it before. It's the only reason I'm worried. But it's out of care, not it's out of friendship. Um, Sorry, Jay, but I didn't understand what you said. I said I'm not sure. I I need you to be You know, I don't, I don't want to approach it anymore. I don't think we should talk about stream this much behind your back. May I at least know what you were going to say a moment ago? And then we can drop it. You said you were going to need me to be something for a moment. And then you wanted to drop it. You're asking for me to just be there for her by will. I'm trying to remember what I was saying. That's the problem. Um, you know, I can't remember what I was saying. So, I guess that's where it ends then. So. Let's, I guess, 
move on to something else. Any idea what we're doing next? Did she show you what's happening? No. Um... If she didn't tell me, I don't want you to tell me. So we're gonna have to be doing some very non-combative things for me. Can I make a roll to see if I can pick up what that means? You can certainly try. Okay. What what, what would I roll? The strings right and she's weak as fuck. Insight? Yeah. Thank you. Better than the 11 I got earlier, technically. I don't think I can really gleam much from that, though. That's a stretch. <laughs> Can you gleam anything at all? Uh, that's up to the DM side where 15 gets me. Jay speaking straight facts and truth, and there ain't. He may have, like, wiggled his nose a little bit, but. He very clearly has to sneeze, because he keeps turning his head like he's going to sneeze. Akio grew up in, like, warrior culture, so I'm trying to think if he would be guess at this. Guess at what? The stream's ready to fight! So, if we're unable to go on something more combative, that means that something's wrong with her combat capabilities, correct? I just think we should take it slow for a while, and give everyone time to recover from what happened. I mean, I'm sure you and Q want to take some time. Q needs some time to really get attuned to and become real friends with uh, Will Tuggle. And need to kind of ease into that next thing that we're doing. We have a lot of lieutenants to go through, and it's not going to be easy to do any of them. Oh god, to know. But hopefully with us, we'll do it. However, I understand that can't always just go straight into something and hope for the best, as some would say. So, let's, like you said, take it slow. See, this was when I was talking about that burning forest. This is when I like to do a slow and steady approach. I thought you said that... Wait, but didn't you want to be fast about that? Yes. I said, in moments, I have to be fast. But in more relaxed settings, I can be slow and relaxed. So, this is... a fire that isn't that no I was just using that as the example point so, so it's horrible it. you are okay so I'm trying to explain what you're trying to say here it's 
bad, but we're gonna take it slow. Correct? It's fine, but we're gonna take it slow anyways. Oh yeah, Q like definitely that heard fine. that. I feel like that fine is very drawn out. Nope. Uh, nope, 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 nope. I am very confident with what I've said. Stream is fine in her combat capabilities. Q's gonna walk in from outside. I know I got a tour, but, um, Ale? Grog? Do I not know where the kitchen is? Oh. And if you're gonna talk about somebody, you shouldn't let them hear you. Why was my name mentioned? Yeah, Jay, oh. why is her name mentioned? So I can't mention your name in passing? It's gonna make talking about you in the party really difficult if you're not present. And you're pretty sneaky, so it's gonna be really difficult in certain points. We've been talking about stream for a while now. I don't think that using your name in passing would be that bad, Q. It's nothing bad, we were just... We've talked about so much I don't remember anymore. We... Oh, yeah. Ale? Grog? J. Ale? Grog? I don't know where the kitchen is. We don't have a kitchen here, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. So, so... Jay is going to point to the... Second portal? Yeah, second portal. Um... Honestly, I don't even remember the lights the the lefts and the rights here. You're gonna walk out into this stable. It, 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 as soon as Jay goes, you're gonna walk. Q just <laughs> that's funny. Thanks for volunteering. I'll be out there and walks back out. Wait. Oh. Okay. Well, Akio, since you're gonna be getting the drinks for her <laughs> because I know she's going to make you. Go through that door. You're gonna go out to this open kind of courtyard, I think. And then there's gonna be an inn and the stable. I think the inn's to the right. I really don't remember. Jay, you just led me into a room with a mimic not even an hour ago. Are you sure you have your rights and lefts correct right now? I don't remember the the lefts and the rights for the portal, so <laughs> yes, I, I completely believe that I know that it is to the rights. Technically, when going through the uh, portal, both of them are to the right because you come out on the side of the tavern. <laughs> perfect, perfect. Give me one moment. Perfect. <laughs> oh waiting for someone to say it. To be fair, though, the stable is officially very different than the tavern. Hopefully yeah. you can tell the difference. Ho hopefully. I can't imagine he wouldn't be able to. He's just gonna put his hand on your shoulder as he stands up. He's like, oh, wait, tomorrow are you sitting? Actually, Melinda, do you want food and drinks? She'll nod her head because she knows then she gets to learn where they are and she knows she's not going with you. Okay. Uh, and he's also going to look at the children that need to be fed. Make note of that. Their eyes are glittering. You said food. We can find something that'll work there. Yeah, let's go, Yaki. I'll show you where to go. Uh, one, two. 
He just kind of cocks his head for a second, and then he'll follow you. There. No, this is probably where Suze is. Oh my gosh, Strings here? No way. God, this is... <laughs> this forgot Stinky was here. <laughs> I forgot Marcus I was Hosh here. is here! He most certainly is not. Oh. You can't make fun of him and his potential girlfriend. Only potential. To the right. No, yeah, to the right. Yeah. I, I think to the right was the right direction. Looking at this map. Oh, gosh. Akio's met Sh Sugar, right? He's yes. met Sugar. Yeah, okay. Technically, Akio has been here before. He's just didn't. It's been a long time. It's been a really, really long time. A lot's happened, as well as, um, he doesn't exactly know that this was the kitchen. Was is. That's not foreshadowing. What? That's what I was looking for. Hero and Phoenix. After about 10 more minutes, Q's gonna walk back in looking for that grog that was supposed to be coming. Alright, I'll remember to cue you when they're inevitably there more than 10 minutes. <laughs> I hear this definitely feels familiar, like you've been here before. Mm -hmm. Uh. Deja vu. It's on the menu. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I don't have. Are you asking this out asking. loud? No, he's just looking for a menu. <laughs> there is none. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Man, Joey's antisocial habits are really coming out here. <laughs> Why do you think I sit in a bush and hunt and shoot people? You don't sit in the bush, bitch. You get sick of sitting in the bush and then you push uh. forward with a rifle. Just like the Founding Fathers intended. <laughs> okay, we will go. Composure. Okay. Any good food recommendations, Jer? Yes. Just yes. Yep. Ah, damn it. <clears throat> Akio will, um... How, how busy do they look? They're steady. By no means through the roof busy, but they're not hurting. Could... I, like, politely ask one of the bartenders what they have to eat? <gasps> Alright, I'm, I'm gonna... <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> Gonna, I'm just gonna show you who's behind the counter. Oh. One. One. Okay. There's and sugar. Two. Uh, I do. I have a do I have a sense of deja vu about either of them? Does he go with the one that he's familiar with? <laughs> You've seen them both in the keep? Yeah. Shit, you're right. <laughs> yeah. Give me one moment. I'm just gonna do this because I don't remember how to type it out. Sugar it is! Oh. Bad choice. Should've been stinky. 
Yeah. I rolled for it. <laughs> Sorry. Female, correct. Sugar? Is them thunder thighs? <laughs> I'm just making sure. Um. I probably crush my head with those damn things. We will too. <laughs> Um, ma'am. Well, what can I do for you, sweetie? Oh yeah, right, it's that voice. <laughs> yeah. Sugar is southern and um, southern can be. Yeah. Um... Do you have a food menu or anything? Just tell us what you want, sweetie. Oh god. So for a moment, he thinks to himself, and then he kind of snaps out of it because he's thinking of his home food. Any good recommendations? How special? Sweetie. What do you want? Meat and fruit, if that's fine. He doesn't know the animals around here. Now, you... now, darling, I've been running tavern business for a while. Even before that, I worked with some tavern people. And we're, we're going to ignore the bits in the in-between, but regardless, if I tell you, tell me what you want, you won't tell me what you want. We're not gonna do this pussyfoot and shit. I mean, no, I, I, it was just a cat, but at the last point. Good morning. Sticky would have been easier. <laughs> um, Sticky just wouldn't have responded. <laughs> He'd stick mm -hmm. his tongue out at you. <laughs> uh, do I know what a deer is? I imagine I would. I would hope you know what a deer is. You don't know what a deer no. is. Uh, you're gonna, you're gonna have issues. Um, some venison and apples. Day is just looking over at you. He just looks very uncomfortable. Oh. Okay, so what I'm hearing is, you want me to go outside? Want me to go grab you a nice big old buck and set him in front of you and feed him apples. Uh, no, 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 that's not what I meant. <laughs> yeah, um... Sweetheart, does your dish have a name? Are you looking for some, like, uh, apple pie? Uh, maybe just some, uh, some eggs will do. <laughs> some raw eggs will do. <laughs> Uh, Alright, I'm gonna uh, do you uh, one I'm gonna do you uh, one sweet because clearly you ain't picking up what I'm putting down and you just a little special. Uh, <laughs> but it's an omelet? But I'm I'm used to your type. Uh, I'll be back. Used to my type. JD and also can I just say bringing in a woman who's part deer and you asking for venison is pretty rude. <laughs> I'm just gonna say that too. <laughs> now, Jay. That's what the look was. That's what the look was. <laughs> yeah, I know. Now, Jay, can I do anything for you? Um, well, I was just getting the, uh. Why am I. Why am I just <laughs> looking to Southern? Oh my goodness. Because... Virginia? Anyways. Anyways. Yeah. Um. I, I'd suggest getting the, the kids their meal first. Kids are easy, sweetie. You give them the little chicken nuggets and you shape them like dinosaurs and they freak out. I guess um, a nice like slab of ribs or something. Just kind of like looking between you and Melinda. 
All right, I'll be back. And don't worry, I got your little sweet thing something. I... <laughs> All right, that's that's fine, I guess. <laughs> However, she will <laughs> step out. Booger wore the pants in that relationship, and Doc was a fucking beast. <laughs> he was a barbarian, too! A beekeeper barbarian. Yeah, and he was the bottom! <laughs> oh, that fight was legendary. <laughs> Someday we'll finish that one shot. Um, however... You all simultaneously just aren't looking at Stinky for half a second, and there's just filled drinks in front of all of you. Thank you. Thank you. And when you when your eyes like finish that blink, and the drinks are in front of you, Stinky is no longer looking at you guys with his tongue out. He's looking at the wall, and you can assume his tongue is probably out. So how have you been, Sugar? Sugar walked out. She went to go oh, talk to... Trini. Trini. <laughs> you know, the the chef that supplies all the food to the keep. Yep. Akia does look very uncomfortable now. <laughs> but, Akia, why are you... Why are you uh, I, uh... So, Melania's here with us, correct? Melania? Melinda. Melinda. I am Melania. Play. More angry Melania. about that one than the deer, but I digress. Melinda I is here. With I don't know how correct. she's feeling about it. it. Melinda is with us, correct, though? Yes, she is with you. Akio's gonna look over. I'm sorry. She does not seem phased. <laughs> he is. He is what? phased. What, you gonna next apologize to stream when you eat fish? Yes. <laughs> I, I have a question. Yes. When did I miss Akio failing his fortitude save or his constitution save for the disease he has? The what? The disease Akio has. Foot and the mouth. <laughs> I don't even understand that. Maybe I'm just too stupid. <laughs> Makes it all the better. I love I'm it. just too stupid. I did not. I did not put you my also have a bad case of of ligma. I'm gonna <laughs> kill you. That what I do get. <laughs> you get foot and mouth. I don't understand that one. <laughs> Somebody explain to my tiny pea brain, please. What? The foot in mouth. Inserting what? foot in, in mouth. mouth? Yes. Yes, Glenn. It just doesn't make sense, like... Maybe my tiny... You know, it's just me. It's just me. It's a skill issue. Have you ever heard the phrase, putting your foot in your mouth? No! Okay, well that's where we do that. Ah. Fair enough. Then I will leave it to Google. Google's a wonderful thing. Oh God! <laughs> uh, yeah, actually, I don't know if I'd Google that one. That one might no, be a little dangerous. I don't think I want to. <laughs> Let it go. No, I don't want to Google that shit. Okay, you know I could easily try to block it. I have an idea. But in mouth. Say yank. Ah. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> Say something foolish, embarrassing, or tactless. Yeah, that's right. Uh
this is probably about when uh, you, Q would make it in. Q's gonna walk back in, look around for J, Akio. And, and nobody can be found. And she sure as hell is not going through a portal. Uh, she looks around on the first floor to see if she sees anybody she recognizes. Really recognizes, not just somebody that was introduced recently. Um... Passive's a 14. You're just looking around the the keep, the, right? The yeah, the first floor there. Um. I mean, the the amethyst kobold is there, and she was in the um. She was... In the tavern. Yes. Thank you. Word was not coming to me for some reason. Nope. I gotta find somebody else. Say there really isn't anybody else. Okay, gonna run. I think it would be upstairs. Yeah, gonna run upstairs. Grab Gakio's room. Literally, run. Well, his room isn't upstairs. It's on a side wing. But you go there. I always said it's upstairs. Empty. Oh yeah, the stream said it was upstairs, and Akio had said upstairs. Said but you do see Rolu on your way through. As I run past, I'm still not that well acquainted with Rolu. Uh, I'm just gonna. Dragon's got some new paint, and just keep on trucking. He runs out. <laughs> I'm assuming I find no, uh, no Akio. No Akio. Guess I'm going down the basement. All right, you go down the basement. Yeah. Else for me. Uh, there's no one you recognize on the second level. Oh, I know, I know where the rooms are. Somebody gave me a tour. Yeah. So I'm assuming. I also, apparently, I forgot to do it to Akio. I I also know the difference between the right door and the left door. <laughs> and don't use that right door. Yeah, well, somebody told me that. Stream was very, very, very adamant. Don't walk in that door unless Stream goes through it first. <laughs> So, gonna walk, well, gonna... It winds up being using drugs anyway. Uh, oh! The, the, the walk has apparently mellowed her. Uh, Q is going to knock on Stream's door. Alright. You do so. The first person to knock. <laughs> Granted, when Jay came in, the door was open. <laughs> Granted, you let me in. I didn't let you in. I just walked into my room. Then I walked in. Did you ever in. 
checks are uh, out Q, of the Q's gonna walk in. She's currently sitting at a table writing something. Hello? Hey. I asked for some grog or some ale. Jay said, pointed at a portal. I said, no. They could go get it. And she's like, it's been quite a bit. And they're still not back. Hmm. And you're the only person I know. Well... I mean, I'm sure they're just waiting on their orders. Everything's cooked after you order it. <laughs> and I'm sure Akio gave them a hard time on, uh just ordering whatever he wants because I don't think he understands that the proprietress has traveled the world and probably knows almost any dish he can think of. <laughs> so... I mean, they should be back soon. Because of the current condition of their relationship. Ugh. Pretty much any time Q talks to stream now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, tell him the truth. <laughs> that she. I mean, she's telling the truth and then embellishing it with what is likely her hypothesis of why they're taking forever. Well, I misspelled that. It should be an E. I had a feeling it'd be that. <laughs> <laughs> so they're, they're gonna be a while. It depends how slow they are. <laughs> Maybe 15, 20 more minutes. It also depends if they even remember that they were supposed to bring it back. They've been known to just kind of do their own thing. Specifically Akio. So would you mind in telling him that it's it's not nice to enter someone else's bed without permission? <laughs> Do what? Uh... I was trying to relax and he just he dove right in. <laughs> Q, Q is going to Q, Q's gonna look around the room and see no bed. There's no bed, there's just a pond. Yeah. Were you spying on him? Spying on him? No, I was I was resting in my bed and he jumped in. <laughs> I love. <clears throat> I get that you and I have not been on good footing. <clears throat> I'm also not blind. The pond is my bed. It's where I sleep. Never mind. I was going to say there was no bed. <laughs> I had a feeling that that's where the misconception came from. <laughs> I, I forget that some people sleep in normal beds. <laughs> you sleep in a pond, I sleep in a hammock, you know.
so um, one inch or two. Huh? Huh? Oh, I'm wondering how much I should cut off. Cut off of what? You said he jumped into bed with you. True. It depends how much you want to make him bleed. Oh, my. Although I have learned the shallower the cut, the more painful it tends to be, so... That's what vinegar's for. Or salt. Hmm. I'll try that next time. There is complete miscommunication between these two. Can't wait for Akio to blow up on this. Or get blown up. Okay. Who's making this new insight? Because stream is not being anywhere near as snarky as usual. Well, I, I rolled an 18 to 19, so... You can tell that there's a lot on Stream's mind. And right. she's just, like, like you said, just not as cocky and starky. <laughs> she's just more grounded and sad. What's wrong? Hmm? What is wrong? You're gonna ask me that too, Nail? <laughs> yeah, there, there's a difference. I'm supposed to step into combat with you. I need to know where your head's at. But, but whatever things you have going on, we're not on that level. I don't give a shit. I just need to know where your head's at. And I need to know whether I can trust you in combat. That's it. My headspace won't affect my fight. If that's what you're worried about. Because whatever's going on... I'm gonna be honest, I'm not gonna try and help you with it. Because as I said, first. I don't care! you and me I think you're a Dunga a what? Uh, <laughs> useless I couldn't agree more my personal opinion is you're also a Vel Singer uh, uh, <laughs> puny wretch Mm-hmm. But, my personal feelings aside, whatever you're letting get in your way, you're an idiot. You're still alive to fix it. Get out of your own way, fix it, move on. The only way you can't fix it is if you're dead. You need help fixing it, that I'll offer help with. I'll be sure to come to you if I need help.
but nobody can fix your own problems without you working on it. Turns to head back out the door. Stops. And how long do we normally sit around and do nothing? Normally it's never this long. If we're not off doing something tomorrow? I'm dragging you upstairs. Okay. At, at least upstairs you can well you can wallow while you train and fight. get plenty of training down here, but you're not wrong. Q heads back upstairs. As, right. as Q leaves, Stream's just gonna say, thanks, Q. For what? The respect you get is the respect you've earned. I'm not going to give you something you haven't earned. I don't expect it. But that was a genuine thank you. And then she just go, go back to writing. Q goes back upstairs. You go back upstairs. <laughs> Those two get along great. <laughs> But it got the point across. But it did. <laughs> I could see the DM as I was using words like, what does that mean? I don't know what that means. Don't need to know what it means to get a point across. <laughs> I pulled up Viking words. There you go. <laughs> well, Stream doesn't know those. <laughs> I mean, just wait until you guys find out what uh, Hugh's working on outside. So, what is Q doing now? Uh, Q, Q is going to sit at the... Q is going to drag a small table over so that she is in line with the portal that they were supposedly going through. So that there's enough room for people to come out, but she's right in front, and is just going to sit there with the, uh, the wood axe she's been using. Okay. You do so. Uh. Flip over to the other one. Uh, 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 Sugar comes back and um, brought in, uh, set in front of Akio. It's a nice. There's like a little rectangle dish that has some pot stickers in them. Then served with it is a bowl of rice. Uh. Yoza and rice. <laughs> And then some brain words, some ri rice, some seaweed papers, and a small dish of chicken gizzards that have been fried with an, an even smaller dish of like some fried fish. You can tell it's hard for them to get fish, but they do have fish. Um, Jay, you have some nice pork ribs put in front of you, and they're just dripping in juice, falling off the bone. 
Uh, <laughs> put in front of Melinda is a really nice looking summer fresh salad. It's got all different berries and nuts and bright fresh green lettuce. No dressing. No dressing. No dressing. No dressing. The driest salad imaginable. Not really. Not when you consider the fruit factor. Well, in. yeah, true, true. But it's got like blackberries, blueberries, pecans, uh, oranges, apples, and sunflower seeds. All mixed in. The sunflower seeds is a good addition. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> that was a random thing I wasn't expecting at the end. And then in front of the kids, one, she's brought in chocolate milk for them. <laughs> and just as she said, there's all different assortments of chicken nuggets. There's like a dragon one, a kobold, some dinosaurs. Uh, an owl bear. I ordered some of that myself. Damn. <laughs> so real quick, I, I'm so sad I cannot eat nuggets right now because of the fucking vegetable oil. I'm so upset. Yeah. And then they've got like a, a small dish of broccoli and mashed potatoes. And you you hear Sugar whisper to them that if they eat all their food, she'll let them have dessert. She's a mom. She knows what kids are like. Greatest idea ever. But, uh, you guys got your food. Eating. What? Um, wait, hold on. Akio. Weren't you supposed to bring something for Q? Or get Q? Or... You were given alcohol. You were given alcohol when sh uh, Sugar went to take the food order back. You don't know who gave you the alcohol, but alcohol was put in front of you. I'm guessing they wouldn't let me take the cup back, would they? You have no clue. He wouldn't have drank any of it then. Try to. No, but he's also he would have fucking ass. Is this that? I don't know. Akio was going to sigh and go back to that portal. You uh. Get some alcohol. You, you could order a bottle. Yeah, I'm about to. Ah, she said. Grog or something, right? I've never even had Grog. <laughs> but I know of at least. You've definitely had some Grog in your life, I can guarantee it. <laughs> Might not know what it was, but you definitely had some Grog in your life. Okay, um, I will order a bottle of Grog. All right. However much did that cost? They don't tell you. Uh, they have to stop trying to ask for the price. <laughs> he doesn't know how. However, he now has alcohol and the food, so thumbs up there. We employ like half of these motherfuckers at the keep. <laughs> yeah. As well as you don't know what Susie pays them or what yeah. they pay Susie. Wait, we're just Susie's money laundering game? Oh, of course! <laughs> I should have known. Susie is really smart. <laughs> oh. Just all a part of her you see my message, game. by the way, Tiff? Oh. <laughs> That's my response. In that case, I'll probably do that. Okay. However, 
However, is there anything the rest of you are doing? Uh, going to making sure the kids don't run away off into the city. That's okay. a big one. So that, then... That's kind of the main thing. We'll flip over to Akio and Q, because I think Akio's bringing a bottle of alcohol over. You want to describe again what he sees when he steps through the portal? <laughs> Is he even going to step through the portal? That's the real question. <laughs> um, well, here's the thing. When he steps up to the portal... Because you said you can see through it, right? Yes, correct. Yes. Okay. One, before he even gets to the portal to see it, in front of the portal are these little wood shavings that Q has been throwing through as she's been just taking it off the table. Oops. Uh, but yeah, through the portal is Q just sitting there at a table, staring at the portal, axe in hand. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, with this food and alcohol is going to walk through. What the fuck else am I gonna do, right? Why are you shaking your head? I don't know, you get a voice, you can talk through that portal. <laughs> what am I gonna say? <laughs> I don't know what's transpired. <sighs> Got your alcohol cue. Oh. Did you, um, wet your appetite earlier? Eh. <laughs> I mean, I'm well, pretty see, hungry right now. See, see, why you were, why you were gone? Uh, I found out that you jumped into another bed. <laughs> oh, what? I jumped into a pot and it's going through his head and then he's going to scream. <sighs> he is going to... His eyes are wide right now. Besides her being underaged and everything else in between that is wrong with that. He is going to walk over, set down the food. He's going to walk over with the alcohol and just hold it out. Mm -hmm. I had no idea that was her bed of all things. What else to do with a girl when she says she's your entertainment? Don't know it's a girl's bed. You, you don't seem to know a lot about women. Oh, it just came out my it just came out my mind. Q's gonna take the alcohol and just point at the stairs. Go apologize. Akio is going to walk downstairs to apologize. And, and you're, as you start walking, and you're doing this of your own accord. You're not doing it because you're being told. I was going to say I'm sorry eventually. However, going just, there is a good idea. When you're done with your apology, just ask Stream one question. One or two. And bring me the answer. Okay. He'll go downstairs. And he'll knock. There's no reply. <laughs> oh my god, I do not need this. Uh, stream. I know you don't want to talk to me right now, but I'm sorry. Actually, where where are you trying? 
are you knocking at the door to the room with the pond or just yes, the uh to the room with the pond? You can't get that far. Ah shit. <laughs> the, you you get down to the bottom floor, go to open the first door and it doesn't move. He'll knock on that door then. Still no response. Ah Dream. I don't know if you can hear me. However, I'm sorry. I did not know the pond was your sleeping. I didn't know it was your chambers. I didn't know it was your bed. <laughs> However, I need you to give me an answer. Can <laughs> one or two? No response. <laughs> So you'll wait there for five minutes and you'll say one or two again and then if nothing happens for another nothing. like minute he's gonna walk back upstairs no response at all but as soon as the ears crest the top of the stairs well she didn't talk to me. I did not see her. I do not know if she even heard me. So I will say it again once I see her. I can't just get circumcised while I'm eating ice cream. This is great. I got a show to this. What? <laughs> I don't think I started Ryan. <laughs> Circumcision's half off. Well, like. I don't know. I'm not even making a joke on that. It's okay. Q was gonna leave, use a joke downstairs, but realized that she was talking to Stream, and Stream is slightly naive, so didn't use the joke that she was going to use. Asking me to ask her for one or two. See, that's between me and Stream, since me and Stream had a nice talk while you were gone. I'm very worried now. You know what? I'll put your mind at ease. You, you don't have to ask her one or two. We'll, we'll even forget that question entirely. I'll give you a new one. Just ask Stream, salt or vinegar? Okay. Guys, go look with more questions now. Outside, and just after walking past Akio, go and make sure you tell Well Tuglet that 
he looks fierce now. And just keeps on going. Okay. Okay, that's finally going to sit down and start eating his food, I guess. <laughs> A little uneasy, probably, but... Just something that kind of reminds him of home. <clears throat> You're very impressed, actually, how well it is and how closely it reminds you of home. I think it's just now more, more or less asking himself, how did Sugar know their cuisine so well? It's a good question to ask. Only if you were here to ask, but you are sitting by yourself at a table. I'm gonna come back! <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe next time when Sugar's around, he'll ask. If I don't kill her before then, I mean... Only a monster would do that. Somewhere, Q just gets this wicked grin. Yes, less competition. <laughs> less competition. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if the DM Q kills off uh, Sugar. Well, then, then Stinky is unleashed, and we don't know what happens when Stinky's unleashed. She's the only thing keeping that man yeah. restrained. <laughs> Who knows none of this? <laughs> it's no, none this of us is un... their obsessive joke that they have constantly made. That man is a fucking menace to society, and you know it. He is not. If, if even Lord Jay stinky. can't see him ever in his movements, this way, does... way powerful, way powerful. <laughs> it's not our fault. You creep made him to be this. This derpy ass character that's very clearly the bad guy in disguise. You're ridiculous. Absolutely freaking ridiculous. So, from outside, you you can hear just more chopping and hacking and. <laughs> He was at all kinds of fun while you guys were doing nothing. <laughs> Ooh. Jay, you have a lovely meal. With lovely company. Yeah. And the yeah. kids. After a while, Q's gonna walk back in. It was. Um, Sarah? The one running the keep. Susie. 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 I'm horrible with names, I'm sorry. I just was trying to figure yeah. out who you met. Yeah, Q is yeah. looking for Susie. Um, I will tell you now, you search all over the keep and she is not there. Susie go when she's not at the keep. I feel like that's a question everyone's beginning to ask themselves. Uh, Susie's the BBEG. Very clearly. <laughs> Running her money laundering scam. Like, where do you um, figure it Q, being Q, remembers the last time that Su Susie had an issue. 
Star starts walks over to the table where Akio is and just starts brushing the wood shavings onto the floor. Oh, Dirty the damn keep floor. Because, you know, you make a mess, Susie just magically appears, apparently. <laughs> like a Roomba. I don't know how this started. Not how it works, but sure, you do that. A Roomba with glowing red eyes just standing behind you menacingly. Knock the shit out of you. Uh, I'm not sure. Again, I don't know how this joke started, but apparently this is where it is. Akio's eating his food. <laughs> watching watching you brush wood onto the floor. Why are you do doing that? Couldn't find Susie. So... I, last time I threw pebbles through and got yanked through by Susie, so... I figured making a mess is how Susie appears. <laughs> Not to... Uh... <laughs> breaks your bubble cube, but um, that's not how that works. Oh. <clears throat> well, fine. You know where I can get some tar? Tar? No clue. But why tar? the project I'm working on. I need tar. What are you working on? I just said the project I'm working on. What's the project? Oh, I'm just curious. You. you know, you could go outside and see it. It's okay. I didn't know it was outside until just now. People that <coughs> sorry, got some rice in my throat. Um, Plus one. You're, you're, you're supposed to chew and swallow, not inhale. It's not the only thing that could be stuck in your throat. <laughs> Something was stuck in his throat at one point. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> Man can't breathe. Look downward, Shadow. Close you know your what? airway. You know what? <laughs> He's just getting choked okay. up. Q's too cute for him. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Got this. Uh, I'm going to do this because it's the easiest one here. To give me the high flick. Nope. Oh, she, God. She, is just, she is just going to smack you on the back. That was a weaker smack, too. A good smack. Look. Just a piece the first, of the rice. I'm flying the first out. One, the first one's always the light one. Yeah, it's once you go back for round two that you, you know, uh -huh. <laughs> break the spine. I just get Mortal Kombat X-rayed. Oh, no. Oh, no. Does the rice come out on the first smack? Is he still coughing? No, not right now. But I'm did, afraid to talk. He's free. <laughs> did he evolve into a wheezing? Apparently. Oh <laughs> okay. The uh. You good? You, good? you better? I think so. Cough. That's it such in. a good joke. That's that's. Oh no. Okay. Good, we're good. The people who would know where to get tar. Uh oh. We're getting that rice out. There we go. <laughs> Too hard. I 
can't believe something's too hard for Akio. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Got him. People who would know are Susie, which I'm pretty sure is why you're trying to find her. Jay, because he. Maybe not Jay, he's bad giving directions. And then. Dream. <laughs> Those are the people that would know where Tara is around here. Stream has until tomorrow morning. Before I bother them again. And I guess I'm waiting on Susie or Jay. Jay should be back soon. <laughs> if you want, I can go get him. Or ask him to hurry up. Let the man have like an hour of peace with the girl that that we just rescued for him. <laughs> no, don't. It doesn't stick with the shtick of what you guys do to no. it every single time. Hey, stream has not interrupted him. <laughs> this time. Yeah, although honestly, stream, has been, stream has been constantly interrupting herself. Yeah. So. <laughs> to the point her uh, door's uh, locked. Yeah. Stream's sitting down there going, oh, is this how Jay feels? <laughs> no. No. She doesn't think things through. She just doesn't relate it to Jay. She's just like, man, this is annoying. I would hate to have this happen all the time. <laughs> oh. This is, this is a Jay's problem. No one comes to Jay, and then eventually it all goes really wrong, and then everyone comes at the same time, and then that's what happens. So, Q, Q's gonna go back outside. Alright. Let me know if any of that, all that's okay, by the way, Tiff, in Discord chat. I will, I'm just... You have to understand a lot going on in all different places. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you guys. I'd send it through Discord, but, I mean, through Roll20, but, uh... It's easier to send that stuff through Discord. Yeah, that works, but... I'm gonna alter the first thing in one way, which is just... Mm hmm I figured. There. Just that one minor alteration. Okay. Um, however, for better or for worse, you guys spend the rest of your evening however. Oh, stop. <laughs> Is there anything else you guys want to do for this day before I push this day to a close? I need to find out where the tar is. Um, oh, yeah. Susie would Does eventually... Jay come back? Susie, oh, Susie and Jay would back. both come back, but I think Jay would come back before Susie would. Probably. Would Jay know where we have tar? Oh, here's, a, here's a great thing. There's this really nice alchemist who lives in the keep named uh, Sylphine. Who has an alchemy lab in the uh, first floor of the basement? Yeah, so <laughs> who likely you... knows where Tar is. Tar? Yeah, I guess. So that'd be the best you spot. would ask Susie. Susie would walk you down to the second floor, open up the cabinet, and be like, "We have a fully Tar. stocked alchemy station." Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I didn't know that would be an alchemy supplies. Yeah. 
It's how you make um like the the weird web glue throwable potion. Yeah. Please tell me the kid has left that storeroom. <laughs> well, he would eventually got a torch and gone down and tried to have a conversation with you. Which He would have been granted access. <laughs> which then he'd obviously see you're not human, and then that would prompt a new conversation. Yeah. Which, we'll do that. There are certain we'll things I want to get to, so... Yeah. We'll, we'll have... I talk to you eight hours a day. I'm certain we will have time. <laughs> yeah. Um. However. I just. Uh, yeah. she shows you where the tar is. Q, Q takes about a, a full bucket full of it. Okay. And goes back upstairs. leaving Jay to wonder what Q needs tar for. Probably not the weirdest thing someone in this party has asked Jay for. I can't think of anything off the top of my head, but probably not the weirdest. Definitely Pretty sure not. Stream has asked him to help cut out the eyes of a creature before. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you did. Jay's just going to assume it's for some kink of Akio's. Probably. <laughs> Oh Fuck. man. Fur and tar. <laughs> I thought it was tarring and feathering people. <laughs> Is there so anything else you guys are doing for the day, though? Akio <laughs> needs a good waxing. Nope. Relax. Nope. You know what I'm doing. That's all Akio's doing. This man's really trying to find inner peace. <laughs> It ain't gonna happen, buddy. Ain't happening, buddy. <laughs> you gotta take care of some of the outside problems before you can start working on the inside. Nope. You gotta work inside the now. That's how it works. <laughs> it not I don't know. I'm not a monk. <laughs> so, sh should I roll a constitution save to see if I wake up? What do you mean? What? <laughs> Are you gonna fucking die in your sleep? You drink, you um, drink a bucket of tar. You, you, no. You've never heard that as the, the running joke for DMs. They make their players roll a con save just because. Yeah. <laughs> I, and, I do that with an old person. Or just, or just when, you know, they're walking down the road, you ask for a perception check, and uh -huh. then you never elaborate. Uh-huh. <laughs> that's, that's one. Yeah. All right, it's warning. Everybody give me a constitution check. <laughs> Why? Why? Okay, uh, you're all good. Just keep them on their toes a little bit. <laughs> Tiff's sitting here going, "Hey, I'm learning new things." <laughs> no, she she knows it. She's made she's made us roll randomly before. Oh, I have. <laughs> and we still have no clue if that was there was ever actually a purpose with it. <laughs> so, when Q wakes up, Q's gonna go right back to work on the boat. Alright. By the way, Q just used normal paint on uh, Full Well Tuglet. Okay. But I will give you a minute or two. I have to be right back. Alright. Frame doesn't leave her room. You guys uh, all congregate for breakfast, and Stream does not congregate for breakfast. Mm -hmm. Okay, we'll get Stream. Can I get a in note, by the way? The morning. You want a note, Glenn? Yeah, to type the thing. <laughs> oh. Actually, he'll bring a plate of food down for her. That's what um... he's doing. Let me. I'm gonna put it in C. 
I mean, we have um, Eternal Order stuffs and notes. What are you doing, uh, Ryan? Is bringing a plate of food down for stream because he's gonna at least try and get food for her even if she doesn't want to talk to people. All right. Um. As you're like going down the stairs, you just feel the over looming presence of the kid, just kind of like kind of wanting to go with you, watching over your shoulder. I mean, did you want to bring her the food? She might, might actually take this from. She might actually take this bit from you. Well, we could go together. <laughs> Does he have a torch this time? Yes. <laughs> you should probably just get a lantern. <laughs> Pretty sure Susie's already done that. However, you go down the stairs, Jay. Make it streams room. Knock, knock, knock. There's no, no. response. No response. <laughs> if uh, you want food, it's sitting out here by your door. If not, I'm sure Ace will love it. Uh, give me a, just a general perception. Oh, well, that's the GM, but that's still an interesting number. There is not a peep, not even an ounce of sound. The door locked? Nope. No? He's gonna knock one more time, and if then there's no response, he's just gonna peek the door open real fast. No response. You peek the door open, and strangely enough, Jay, the first thing that catches your eyes, you see Stream's trident. Never He's gonna open the door trident. a little bit more and just check the room. Uh, so, go ahead, Glenn. So, you see her trident kind of just resting on top of the pond. And then as you open the door... Uh, you see the table, or I guess it's more of a desk, and you see sitting on it her scimitar and a book. And a note. It looks like the note is sealed and intended to be read, or... It's just folded in half, and written on top is just the letter J. Oh, okay, I'll walk over and open it then. Do you want to show him the note? Edit. it. Oh, God. What's going on, my fellow players? Show two players. My apologies. Specifically, you can note that her uh, last name is scratched out on the note. Oh my goodness, what are you doing, Stram? And since good. you're picking the note up, the uh, the book is her history book, and it's opened up specifically to the page that talks about her father's death. Jay will put the uh, the note as a bookmark in that page and close it. Unless there's something on the page that Stream looked like she wanted Jay to read. I mean, it's a page you've read before. Got it. There's 
She has shown, she has made Akio read this book. So it's but just, Akio. just the trident, the scimitar, the book, and then this note. I'm trying to think if that's everything. <laughs> Can you think of anything else she'd leave behind? Probably the life steel dagger too. Yeah. Basically anything. What about the or You've acquired anything. in your travels. She's basically left behind. Um, her shield. Yes. But her bag and stuff is missing. All of her weapons and everything she used for combat, basically. Yep. Most of the weapons. Uh, the the only things not there are her spare scimitar. Okay. And her... What is essentially her boot knife. You know what? Seeing that not all of her weapons are gone, Jay is more fun. But her plus two short sword, her trident... Her River's Fury, the Lifesteal Dagger, uh, her shield, and her bow. Yep. Along with all the arrows and quiver. Uh, is the key to this room left in this room? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it would be. Okay. There's your answer. Uh, well Jay is not going to take anything but the history book and the notes. He's going to leave all the weapons in there, and then he's going to exit the room and lock everything. Alright, you do so. Making sure the, the kids Poor are... Poor Alphonse. <laughs> Poor Alphonse. <laughs> Alphonse just looks confused. Because he um... obviously didn't see the note. <laughs> You can see by the fact she left all of her weapons here, she's not here. Sorry, I don't know if she's sharing the same feelings you are. Jay, you will probably run into Q as you're going up the stairs and she is coming down. Well, he's still at the door. Well, I'm just saying. He shakes his head no at you and then just walks away. My man refuses. <laughs> Gotta respect his passion. Gotta respect something, because that man's downright devoted. Uh, I believe it's called a Swimming is my passion. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Is that Q walking down the stairs? Hey, Q. Hey! She better be awake. Uh, well, she's definitely awake. <laughs> or probably. <laughs> Maybe she's asleep by now. She only needs half the time. <laughs> <laughs> well, either way, she's getting dragged upstairs. Um... Yeah, I don't think it's going to be necessary. And, and, and why not? Well, because we obviously have to go to... Uh... Aura. She's headed there. Yeah, I can just never be too sure about stream. One moment she will be kind of cooped up, thinking on something, and then the next moment she'll be running out the door and leaving before you even know. So why, Not why too far is, away, though. Why, it's like, why is stream headed that way? Oh, uh, she said something about an undead problem. Uh, 
I guess I don't need this sheet for a while. Nope. <laughs> Congratulations on successfully ditching your party. Thank you. <laughs> so, <clears throat> but before I turn around, two questions. Just two. Uh huh. Are we not supposed to follow? No, oh, it's a. Uh, sorry if I didn't make it obvious. We we're going to Korra to deal with the undead problem. Which is where streams go. Assume so. Second question. Are you gonna go drag Akio or am I? Well, drag him? What do you mean? You said it's undead, we're leaving. You you don't mess with the dead. You let them rest. Yeah. I, I don't know what kind of undead problem it is though. That's because undead is, you know, vampires, but at the same time, they're also very intelligent undead, which means, it's, you know what I mean. It, I, I understand what you're saying. Well, are we going to figure out what the problem is standing around here? No, but uh, I, I can't walk past the stairs if you're on them. I'm. Q, Q has go. already started walking back up the stairs. I can tell you there's people in the keep that know more. <laughs> Probably. So, uh, so, specifically, uh, some people on that second floor. Again. Who, who's getting Akio? Uh, I mean, we gotta, like, repair some stuff first. Like what? My stuff's packed. I don't know. Uh, we gotta make sure that Elias Rolly packs lights. Uh, yeah. Rolly's not going. Okay, Rolly's not going. Well, somebody's uh, gotta stay here and look after Will Tuglet. He nods his head. <laughs> uh, okay, that makes sense to me. Okay, well. I need time to pack them. Got it. 30 minutes after I drag Akio outside, come get you. One hour. I won't budge on one hour. Got it. 30 minutes. Good luck finding me in 30 minutes, because I'll be through one of the three portals, and I know you will not be following me. I'll be back in one hour. The worst part is, the fastest way to Korra is through a portal that we have not, that we can do. Oh, well, I mean, yeah, Jay's been to the city, so I imagine... Yeah, you, you've been dragged there. It's yeah. just a question of, can you convince Q to go through? Uh, we're gonna convince her to go through. It's not that far of a journey by foot, though. No, Q, Q is just going to continue up to Akio's room. Do you so? Oh. Will Akio be awake right now? Like, how like how long have, or has the room been awake for? I would imagine you'd be awake considering everybody else was up for dinner. Dinner, okay. breakfast. Then I'm definitely not eating right now. Oh, that would happen. Ow. Well, was the door uh, uh, unlocked or locked? Lock. No, it can't be locked. Yeah, no that lock door can't door. lock. Uh, okay, well then it doesn't get flung open anywhere near as hard as Q wanted it to. Does it somehow, like, the hinges somehow invert and they hit you in the face? It's just kind of... 
Like, she goes to push it, and her hand slides off, and it just kind of creaks open slowly. He doesn't respond to it. Where is Akio's bed in the room? Is it against the wall? Is it in the middle? <laughs> yeah, that's from what I remember. So just I'm as a reminder, map, so I don't know. this is Akio's room. I'm, uh, Tiff, can you move me to the map, please? Yeah, we're on the, uh... Oh, you map. guys. <laughs> Yell louder. Can we please be moved? We did. <laughs> Which you one's guys, Akio's room? This one. That one. Okay. Oh. Here on the ground. Oh, you're on the ground? Yeah, I'm, I'm on the rug on my knees, like. On your knees. Meditating. Your knees. So. Oh my. Uh, Can't you. Oh god. Ugh. Oh. No, it's not worth it to do that. Uh, Q is just going to walk around behind Akio and reach down and grab the edge of the rug. Uh, what would you like to pull the rug out from under Akio, sending him whichever way he happens to go? Um, give me an athletics. Athletics? Do you want a strength? Uh, no, I'm just... <sighs> Sorry. Tiny writing on the sheet, trying to find it. There we go. Disadvantage, advantage? Just a straight. Okay. Uh, also... Yeah, probably not. <laughs> what was it? <laughs> it's a seven. Oh. Yeah, probably not. You tug at it. Aki, you feel the rug underneath of you being tugged. Um, however, Jay, anytime you're going to do anything, Alphonse is right on your heels and is like, you go, man, I kind of need this for this trip, and he's just ran to go and, gets it, go and get it for you. Uh, yeah, I think he's going to be like, hmm. Like one of those, uh, I don't know what the hell they're called, squires. Yeah. Squires. Yeah, Jay get a squire. Jay got a squire. I appreciate the help, Alphonse. <laughs> he nods and just anytime you need something. Uh, Jay's. Gonna probably go to the Gold Kingdom for a little while. Okay. Just I figured you would. Um. I assume Melinda's gonna want to stay at the keep instead of staying over there. I have no idea. I mean, going to see your mother is always fun. Yeah. I mean, if you leave the portal open. Yeah, the portal is open. But... Especially when. She probably has some good stories of Jay. Who's gonna return the trinket? Yeah, yeah uh, Jay will do that in that hour. He'll return, um, when Cream's siblings? No. <laughs> no. No? Not at all. You, uh, Baan's kids? Yeah. I forget what his actual name was. Yeah, because we all know him as this joke name for what he was, uh... What the fuck is the name of that town? That town? Jabroshi. Jabroshi. I know it without Jibroshi. even looking. Elian's children. <laughs> I know it without even looking. Famous and hero. 
Jay will go to Jabroshi then and drop the kids off. Okay. <laughs> wherever, wherever they're. You'd know where they live based yeah. on the, the like one or two times you visited there with. Stream. Even if you don't, the kids can tell you. Or you could just drop them off at the chief's house like he did us. <laughs> No, like he did Susie. Yeah, I don't think it'll take that long for Jay to get rid of them. Other than to say his goodbyes for the time being. Alright. However, it's is that... Fun. Everything you guys want to tell me for this evening, because it is late. Whoa! Keeps going for the carpet again, isn't she? Yup. <laughs> okay, fucking Considering I know Akio's stubbornness of he's not doing anything, you keep pulling until you pull it out from underneath of him. He's, he just, he did open his eyes and look at her. Just well, see, he just isn't moving. <laughs> it, it's very simple. Seriously, does it pull out from underneath him this time? I'm okay if it's a no. I don't think a 14 would budge him, especially now that he's looking at you. If anything, cool. he kind of, like, wiggles. Wiggles? <laughs> cool. Picks the end of the carpet up and literally takes it and folds it over him and rolls him up into the carpet. <laughs> and picks him up. God it. damn it. I love it. <laughs> Burritos. Dude, if Burritos. I don't know if I need my spell slots, so I'm not gonna fucking use them. Oh, I'm so annoyed with that shit. How do you not have any of your spell slots? I have no. my spell slots, but I don't know if we're going to get into combat or not. Oh, okay. So, so I want to save him. I don't want to waste his second level spell. What? You've never burnt a fourth level spell slot for a, for, for shits and giggles? I'm not going to use Dimension Door for shits and giggles today. <sighs> is, his, is his backpack in the room? Invisible? Q? What the hells are you doing? <laughs> um, Undead, we're going? What? Is his backpack visible? Yeah, uh, yeah the little bit he has. He grabs his backpack. Hope you're packed. We're going. Oh my god. Meanwhile, Akio's katana resting on its stand on the shelf. Please. <laughs> Wait. No. No, the katana. I got a katana. No. What, 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 it, it, if Q sees it, she would grab it. She knows. I, I don't think his katana would be left behind. <laughs> He also would just have to get that. Yeah, it's also like a nope. L literally, Q is going to, while still large, Q is going to grab it and just shove the katana. Doesn't know which end is the head anymore and just shove the katana into the ro rolled up carpet. Look at your top. Is that what oh, I'm hearing? My. Oh my. It's okay, it's in the scabbard. You're going to have to talk to the DM and find out where it goes. <laughs> Do I get katana scam scam up the ass? No, I'll be nice. This one. No, it pickles your testicles. This one. <laughs> but it definitely gives you a heart attack for a solid minute. It just it busts my nut literally breaks. <laughs> yeah, miss the shove it in the carpet, grab the backpack, <laughs> throw it over it's top like, of the rug. It's like cracking an egg. Oh my god. Oh, kill and me. Will purposely hit the door frame on the way out. Ah, oh, bitch! <laughs> you said it, I, I didn't. Mean, son of a bitch! Oh, my face! You said it, I didn't. Oh. Mommy, please don't spite me for his mistakes. Mommy, what the fuck? <laughs> Mommy Q, who you just. Oh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Is that 
mommy thing, though. I'm not saying it is a mommy yeah. thing. <laughs> I mean, soon it might be nothing. What I'm soon. saying is... You just... <laughs> he's about to become a widow, because he's she's about to fuck kill me. Oh my gosh. But literally, takes the carpet, everything, outside, and then just drops it on the ground. Can I get... <laughs> Q, wrong Z character. F, A, D, and O. <laughs> at at yes. some point through all our campaigns, we're going to have used every letter of the alphabet for someone's nickname. <laughs> we got, we got these. Unroll me. We we've already knocked out some of the harder ones with C and Q. <laughs> J. Yeah, then we've got J. Mm -hmm. You is just going to put her foot on the rug and push. You do so. Tiff's just going, what happened to my game? Well, this is about as chaotic as it should be. When we're not on the move. Good, you're awake. Let's go. Oh, oh, oh. I've been awake. And oh. just tosses the backpack at you. Ow. Uh. If you is just going to kind of stand over Akion go, Warrior? Aren't you supposed to be ready at a moment's notice? I am. I know. The, the only difference is we're going to deal with undead, and unfortunately, we're not going to go Viking. I am so lost right now. Besides, I'm thinking one of my ribs has been broken. The faster you get up and moving, the faster you get healed. Oh shit, that's not a problem. Uh, Never mind. Where's Jay? He went through a portal. You don't like portals, do you? It's the only thing keeping him from being beside you right this moment. You seem more... Adam than usual. Um stream left. Good what? for her. She she's solving her issues, I'm assuming. Uh whatever she needs to do. But something about undead, and dead should be left dead, not undead. So they need to rest. Tell that to my home country. We'll go there next. Anyway, up and Why moving. Not? <coughs> I, I just dragged you on a rug. I'm pretty sure I could drag you on a rug there. <laughs> okay. Now, you're, now your choices are rug or no rug. Q. I'm not your damn child. He's going to stand up now. As soon as he stands up, Q will give a heal. My son is being kicked. <laughs> I don't know what a heal means. Uh, let's see. I don't know. I actually have to find him. Oh, give a heal, like... Medicine? No. Oh, I'm being kicked. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Enough for uh, cure wounds right now. Yeah, you're just giving a healing word. <laughs> Lord, oh, oh. Oh, 
close it could be. Welcome to this uh, this campaign too. It should have more. It's just for some reason it's not adding the charisma to it. No, oh. no, it's not. It's got the add ability mod to damage or healing. Yeah, it's just for some reason it's fucking up when it actually goes through. Huh. Yeah, I don't know. I wonder if it's because it doesn't know what ability mod to use. As a multi-classer. Okay, that's what I thought you would say because of... All if right. you could try to wrap your conversation in a way that yep. you can come back to it, I would greatly yep. appreciate that. Yep. The nice thing is, is they are both the same, so... Add three to that, so four. Okay. Your, 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 your ribs are fine, your... Your ego's not as bruised. His ego's in the trash right now. <laughs> and then, yeah, Q Q's just waiting for Jay because she's not going to a portal after me. Uh, Jay is downstairs when you go downstairs. Oh! Then you watch the whole thing with uh, Akio get rolled out. And Q will wait there. Alright, and then that's where we're going to end session for now. Ooh. Trying to make the GM's life easy. Thank you. <laughs> oh, oh, I also want to know. 